Dad? Javi? Is that really you? <laughs> I always hoped I'd find you. I... I thought you were dead, man. I, I thought you'd been dead for, for a long time. No such luck. I knew you were still alive. I knew it! Hey, weapons down! This is my family! You gotta let us in. Kate doesn't have much longer. Jesus. Kate! David? I'm here, honey. I'm right here. What the hell happened? She's been shot. We got the bullet out, but she's still bleeding. We need your doctor. Now, David. What the fuck is she on the ground for? She's barely got a pulse. She's cold as fucking ice. How are you just gonna leave her here like this? He said we had to kneel. I couldn't hold on to her. The fuck you trying to prove, Max? They're outsiders, David. It's what we do with everybody. She's coming inside. But she hasn't been checked. Fuck that. This is my wife. I... I didn't know. Honest. She's going to the hospital. Now. Our doctor's gonna help you, honey. I'm gonna make sure of it. Wait, I I'm going with you. Sorry, but the rest of you have to go straight to quarantine. What for? All newcomers get checked for bites, and they all have to answer a couple of questions. Our doctor will clear the two of them, but the rest of you have to come with me to the quarantine holding area. Don't you get it? I'm David's brother. I'm going to the hospital with them. We have procedures here. Procedures that have to be followed. Even if you are related to David. God, this is bullshit. Come on. Hey, David! Let's go. Without you in it, I didn't know what to think. The engine up and died. I came here looking for help, and this happened. I've been so worried about Kate. I told them she needed a doctor. They promised me someone would look into it. Please, tell me they found her. They definitely didn't look for her, because she was still in the car. But that's crazy! I told them she was dying! And clearly, it wasn't a priority. Well, at least those assholes realized she needed a hospital once they saw her. I'm sorry, Javi. Really, but I didn't have any reason not to believe them. What? The people here in Richmond. Their new frontier. Oh my god. Ho oh, ho ho, you ain't even heard the worst part yet. One of them's his brother. I didn't even know you had a brother, Javi. Maybe it's a good thing. We've got somebody on the inside. Somebody who can vouch for us. Vouch for you, maybe. Javi could be right. At one word from David, and the others came running to take Kate to the hospital. Whoever this guy is, he can't be all bad, right? I mean, he helped Kate instead of hauling her down here. Of course he brought her inside. She's his damn wife. You're kidding. Kate is married to your brother? The way you two acted around each other. I just didn't think she had a husband out there, is all. David was gone. I had to step up, make sure the family would be okay. It's not like I could just walk away from her, from any of them. No, of course not. Family drama aside, Hope you know I'm not about to make nice with New Frontier. I know you didn't have much stake in Prescott, Javi, but they burned that place to the ground for no fucking reason. After everything you folks told me, I'm guessing I'm not gonna find my people alive. Hell, Javi. They killed your niece! Shot Kate! For all we know, your brother could have been behind it. And even if it wasn't his idea in the first place, if he knew about it and didn't stop it. I hate to admit it, but 
There's a chance he gave the order. If he didn't know it was them, if he was just trying to get payback for what was stolen, it's possible. What was he like when you knew? You guys get along? He seemed happy enough to see you up there. If you want to hear me say he's an asshole, fine. He's the biggest asshole I know. Question is, is he a big enough asshole to go along with some of the shit they've done? If your brother knew anything about what happened in Prescott, he's got to answer for it. They all do. I owe that to Conrad. I'm not just going to let things slide. I've never really been an eye for eye kind of man. But people died. We need to even out the scales. We need to look like we're playing along with their rules. Go along with what they say. For now. Then, when the time is right, that's when we demand justice. Hey. Hey. I would have been here sooner, but I had to take care of... something. Come on already, Kate's asking for you. Maybe you think it's okay to keep a lady waiting. What about the rest of my friends? They're not invited. Hurry up now. Looks like the rules don't apply to everyone, huh? That's right. Some people get out of here early. Others stay a long fucking time. Trip, just drop it, okay? Smart cookie, this one. Javi, just go. I'll put in a good word for you, okay? See if we can't hurry the process along a bit. Thanks. Go along with them for now? That doesn't sound good. We have a process. Our own way of doing things. Your guys better not have a problem with that. Things don't go well for troublemakers here. I hope that's clear. David, you threw us in a cell. Don't expect us to smile about it. We do that to protect our people. It's not personal. You sure about that? Come on. Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. Listen, Javi, Gabe... He told me some pretty messed up things. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. He shouldn't have done that. I wanted to tell you myself. Bad news is bad news. Who cares who delivers it? He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. Oh. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? I don't know what to tell you, David. She was too sweet for this fucked up world. You gotta have grit to get this far. How? How did she die? Tell me how it happened. Please, I need to know. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. What kind of animal would just open fire on her like that? An animal with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you don't believe me. Max was a part of this? Fuck. 
I need details. What the hell went down out there? I need to know exactly what happened. Everything you remember. They ambushed us in a junkyard. Just unloaded on us. They chased us back to this town, Prescott. Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. Badger, what the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor, keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. Try not to stir things up. You and your friends could have a very short stay. You wouldn't let that happen, would you? We only just got here. It's not just up to me. I run security here, but it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Who's the fresh meat? Ava. This is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? Welcome to civilization. It's a pleasure to meet you, Ava. Well, oh, is it now? You didn't say he was a gentleman, David. That's because he's not. Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. That woman, the fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. Gabe said you went back to the house. At the start. I'm sorry I never found you. We waited for you. For three months. Eventually the house was overrun and we had to move. Why didn't you come back? Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she... Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. But you were taking care of them, weren't you? Somehow you found a way. I'm not gonna lie. I never thought you had it in you. The day Dad died, I promised I'd stick around. Be there for the family. Well, can't my word. It took the end of the world, but you finally grew up. This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. I'm not staying long. Hey! Hey, kid. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi! Noodles in a cup! We need to get you some real food. Stat. Turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi, I'm glad you're okay. <laughs> Get off me. I was gonna say the same about you. Damn, it's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. I'd have to agree. The key word being alive. Game. Uh, what, you okay? Uh, my... oh, shit. I'll get the doc. I'm fine. I just needed to talk to you, alone. I'm scared, Javi. More than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die, everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? 
David threw his own brother in a cell. Yeah, I know what you mean. This place gives me the creeps. <sighs> I'm glad to hear that. I was afraid you'd been won over by the security here. It's always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that. The first chance we get. This place. It's a cage. We can't let ourselves get locked in. I hear you, Kate. But we can't just turn our backs on this place. On my brother. Javi. We have to try to make it work. I used to say that about my fucked up marriage. Guess it still applies. Whatever. Just please. Please don't leave me alone for too long. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. I think she pulled her stitches when she sat up. Her stitches? I doubt it. But pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. <laughs> I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but all she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills 9 out of 10. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. That would be Eleanor. One of my friends you threw in quarantine. Well, she's no use to anyone there. We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. You can't just cherry pick who you want. Why don't you let them all out? Can they all perform surgery on a dirt floor with a pair of pliers and no anesthetic? There's your answer. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good care of you. Okay? Send my apologies, David. I won't be able to make it. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. Remember what I said? When we meet these guys, keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys. And I will handle him. It may look pretty, but it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, the brother. Javi, meet the guys. Clint runs food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Jones, our bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. Pleased to meet you, Javi. I trust you've been treated well. I hope you haven't been handled too roughly. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. <laughs> oh yeah, the cell you threw me in was totally five-star. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> we have to be careful. I'm sure you can understand. <laughs> we were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach over my magnificent Black Forest Gateau. It's no contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi. Take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. Spinach from Clint's garden? <laughs> or a baked delicacy by yours truly? Everything looks so good, I, I want it all. So polite, David. You sure he's your brother? Can't trust a diplomat. Always saying one thing and thinking another. Please, make yourself comfortable. We value straight talk here, so please. Forgive me if I seem direct. We're usually pretty strict about who we open our doors to. Your brother's word counts for a lot. Is that so? The three of us, and Dr. Lingard, 
make all the decisions here, so, yeah. People who choose to stay with us, they have to deal with us bossing them around. Not saying you wouldn't, but it can be an adjustment. Especially for the more independent-minded. There's no structure out there now. People get used to doing as they please. No offense, but what qualifies you to lead? Testing us already? Just curious who's leading the troops into battle. Everything you see, we built ourselves. If that's not an endorsement, I don't know what is. When Joan and I met your brother, he was trying his hand at fruit. Fruit? We found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty fucking ha. Huh? I helped him bring it back to life. We had a good run there. For as long as it lasted. What happened? What always happens. We trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. Wondering what this fine piece of body art is all about? That looks pretty intense. Doesn't it hurt? It's burned into your flesh. Of course it fucking hurts. It's a sign of commitment, not a Buddhist symbol from your year abroad. It was a crude answer to a difficult problem, and it hasn't always worked. Please understand. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We... we lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain, that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know it's a lot to ask. I know how you feel. Seeing the people I care about suffer, it, it's a terrible feeling. I just want to shield them from it all. It's a noble aim, one worth fighting for. Max? What are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing that can't be worked out. I want to hear that from Javi. Let's just say I wouldn't invite him to my wedding. Yeah, I wouldn't fucking go. Good, because I just said you wouldn't be invited. Max, how did this start? Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? Answer her. I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. If you just asked, we'd have given it to you. That, that's not all. Rufus said Clementine ran his truck off the road just to break him free. Clementine? A girl we had trouble with in the past. You can always judge a man by the company he keeps. Running with that girl don't look good. I would say not. What's your problem with Clementine? You got a lot of hate for a teenage girl. We kicked her out for a reason. Now you two are thick as thieves. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to bandits. We're trying to build something different here. Something resembling civilization. You think I'm bad? You have maniacs running around out there who are much, much worse. I'm not sure what you mean. We hold our people to the highest standards. Javi? You have something to say? One of your people, some asshole called Badger, he put a bullet in a little girl, my niece, David's daughter. What? Damn it, Javi, I told you I'd handle it. No, David, this cousin fucking dirtbag has the balls to accuse me. He and Badger destroyed an entire town. That's enough. No, we need to hear this. Go on, Javi. Sounds like you've got more to get off your chest. They killed a hostage in cold blood, a woman. Francine. Badger did that. Not me. You were right there next to him. I tried to get him to stop, I swear. Cut off her damn finger first. Max. I tried to stop him, I swear. He was out of control. David, we warned you about getting your soldiers in line. We don't know all the facts. We know enough. She's right, David. You've lost control. I want them gone. All of them. Take Javi and everyone in the quarantine to the gate. Send them out with enough weapons to defend themselves, but no more. Look, we...
We can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here. Your doctor friend too. But the rest of you, you're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. It's out of my hands. I can't leave Kate and Gabe alone. They won't be alone. I'll be here to take care of them. I can't help you now, but maybe I can down the road. Just stay alive. Okay? You're lucky I don't gouge your fucking eyes out with my thumbs. You hear me, asshole? David packed this. He did. They said- Start walking. What about Eleanor? Walk. Eat shit. Answer my fucking question. God damn it, Harvey! Let go of me! This isn't her fault, Trip. You're mad at the wrong person. Do not fuck this up. There's a settlement a few miles west of here. Don't come back. Did you piss in someone's oatmeal back there? Thought you were gonna play along. We trusted you. Look, we're not dead. That's something, okay? <laughs> not yet, anyway. Let's just see what they gave us. Knowing them, it's probably a butter knife and a stick of gum. They could have just shot us. More than once. Oh, how fucking neighborly. What's that? It looks like a map. I doubt they give one to everyone. Ava did say David packed the bag. Why the hell is it tied to a baseball bat? David's sense of humor was always poorly timed. Looks like they're expanding. Some of these areas are marked clear. Pretty sure David wants us to go there. We don't even know where the hell we are on this thing. Okay. There's Richmond. That helps. That's where we are. And that's where we need to go. Just gotta head north. And to find north... We need to find the North Star. There. The end of the Little Dipper. No. That's the Big Dipper. That's it. We need to go this way. What else is in there? Not a whole lot. Flashlight. Not enough weapons. No food. Let's go. 